after what are you saying now? Hindi ba ang Pilipino ay bongga? Yeah. Flash a warm smile 
And uh, that's it. <laughs> when he does not know the answer to the question, he's on Match it with a head scratch. Okay. Um, last month, remember Mother's Day, May 12, was it? Dr. Romulo, was it Mother's Day, May 12th? Yes. Okay, May 12th. There's this program, I know you have your TMCs. Yes. You know the program of Boyamunda? Yes. Last Mother's Day, his guest for interview was the former president of the Philippines, Joseph Estrada. So, the first question was, Mr. President, who is the woman you love most and why? Mr. President, faster than a bullet, answers. Mm. <laughs> the woman I love most is my mother because she took care of me from my infantry to my adultery. <laughs> Philippine Airlines, our national carrier, for the trips, the many trips. Thank you very much. Um, during the plane's descent and the fasten your seatbelt sign went on, the flight attendant made an announcement. Kindly straighten up your seats, turn off all electronic gadgets, Pull up your window shades and buckle up for safety. We hope you enjoyed flying with us as much as we did. So we can add in po. Tayo po ay papalapit na sa pali parang pang-international ng Los Angeles. Maari po lamang magbibigay kami ng konting pakiusap lang. Ang mga kumot, una, <laughs> at iba pang kabalitan dito sa kalaklanan ay hindi po asawa sa pasalubo. Huwag po natin ipaklasin ang light jacket at ang LED TV na nakadikit sa silya. Maraming salamat po. Indeed, Grady is the Pinoy. He has a distinct way of naming his children. He names his children after the sound of doorbells, like a ding dong, bing bong, ding ding, and all those things. And he's also fond of using names of endearment, and these are repeated syllables, like we have a bong bong, che che, we have a jun jun, jong jong, mui mui ma ma, bong bong. Oh, oh. Look the fishes in the ocean. All this pattern, we have a lapu lapu samsa. Lapu, asahasa. Even those little exotic flowers like ilang ilang, dayang dayang, wadi wadi, and not exempted from this are the parts of the human anatomy. We have the baba. Dip, dip, bil, bil, bukong, bukong, alak, alakan, kili, kili, suso, and the more private parts. I'm not gonna go there. I'm going to say. If it's an obsession already, uh, even the names of diseases are in repeated syllables. We have an-an, very, very, 
Han Han and Los Los. No wonder we sing happy birthday this way. Happy, happy birthday, happy, happy birthday, happy, 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 happy birthday, birthday. The Filipino is indeed distinct, unique, peculiar, peculiar, different. Well, it probably can be attributed to our being survivors of a medley of colonial influences. Well, as a matter of fact, our national nursery rhyme bears all the traces of this colonial influences. Let's give a listen to our national nursery rhyme. Identity crisis. 